Let's take a look at the number of valence electrons for silver. That's Ag. So if we look at the periodic table, it's organized in kind of a nice way. Elements in group 1, all of these, they have one valence electron. Group 2, two valence electrons. We go over to group 13, sometimes called 3A, that has 3, and so on. But we skip the transition metals. And right here with the transition metals is silver. So silver is a bit of a challenge. Here's how we do it. First off, we need the electron configuration for silver. So this is the electron configuration for silver. If you need help with this, there's a link in the description at the end of this video. Silver is a little bit tricky. It's kind of an exception. So we end up with this electron configuration, and we could reduce this down to its condensed form. So essentially, we want to go to the noble gas before silver. That's krypton. Krypton, this is its electron configuration. So we can replace all of this with just Kr. And this is the condensed electron configuration for krypton. Let's move it to the center. When we talk about transition metals, this is a kind of general definition of what we mean by valence electrons. If you have a transition metal, the valence electrons, those are the electrons that reside outside that noble gas core. This is our noble gas core right here. So we actually have 11 valence electrons here according to this definition. At the same time, we know that silver, it only forms ions that are 1 plus. So it really, in practice, it only loses this 5s1 here when it forms chemical bonds. So you could also say that silver only has one valence electron that's involved in the bonding. So either way, just be able to defend your answer to your instructor. If you follow this definition, we have 11 valence electrons for silver. But if you're thinking about chemical bonding, it's probably better to say that silver only has one valence electron because it forms one plus ions. It loses this one electron and has a one plus charge. And that makes silver a bit of an exception because most of the elements here, they can form ions that have more than one charge. But silver is just one plus. This is Dr. B with the number of valence electrons for silver, AG. Thanks for watching.